For those of you who are subscribers, you would know that I usually buy groceries in bulk. And behind me is my pantry. And as you can see, it is so empty, so empty. Yeah, lucky enough, I did buy lots and lots and lots of tele papers. Uh, is that tele papers or tissue papers? Yes. Um, last year, June, uh, when I resigned, uh, there was a special at Macro where you could buy uh, tissues, uh, these tissues. Let me just show you guys um, these ones yes these ones so i bought a lot like way too much can you see guys so i still have a lot that will go maybe another three or four months um but then i'll wait for a special again before i go and buy in bulk welcome to my channel my name is lindy sherry's in today's video we are going to go buy groceries so for those of you who have been subscribers in this channel would know that i usually go all out and just buy in bulk so today is that day but uh, I do not have enough money. I think the last one that I did, I spent 10,000, but today I only have 6,000. So I'm just going to go and buy um, key things. When I say key things, I mean your Cremora, I'll get six or seven, and then your milk, I'll get maybe 10, and then cornflakes, um, Oros um, as well. And then, um, yeah, there's more like your teen fish, um, your baked beans, um, you know, the key things that I normally need, like your, sh your sugar. Um, I do have my flour and my, okay, I need to stock up on that and then come back and really, really fix this because it is a mess. Um, yeah, we've been drawing everything around. So yeah, that's what I'm going to focus on today. I am going to clean this pantry. Go buy a uh, grocery set macro and then come back and pack everything nicely. And then as well, um, so if you see my cupboards, I try to pack things nicely. How do I? I hope you can see. I try to to like pack things nicely. Uh, I'm not good at it, but then I, I try. So there's this specific cupboard, guys. Yo, 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 it's a mess. The grocery one so usually we'll keep like the main um the main groceries um in the pantry and then the rest we'll put here so can you see the mess that we have here so i need to pack this as well and i i threw my bread uh tin uh because it didn't look nice um it was just um a silver one and it, it was every time i scrub it uh, it wasn't nice so i also need to get a bread tin so that we can remove the bread from here so i also need to organize this um cupboard so there are other cupboards that are not so good but um i'm not gonna focus on that and another thing just an update guys we bought a fridge um let me show you let me show you remember the fridge that we used to have here it was small but now we have this one so yeah so yeah we have a new fridge and at least that part is done and yeah guys uh, so yeah let's go to macro and then we can buy this groceries and finish so my plan is to go during the time when the kids are about to come out of school so maybe they're coming out at half past two so if i go to macro maybe be there at uh one yes at one that should be enough time for me to buy and then go and get them and then come back and maybe they also they will help me with these cupboards so yeah right now i'm cleaning and then after cleaning i need to record a video guys we are launching a series called god answered because there are certain things in our lives where we prayed and god did answer or maybe we were in a really really difficult situation we didn't know how to come out and we prayed and god did answer so i'm studying that series where i'll be um giving people to share their testimonies just to glorify god i mean i woke up with a grateful heart like lord you've done a lot for me like a lot guys like i mean having to do all these things in a short period of time and i am not working and my husband as well doing a lot like guys he's been doing a lot yesterday we finally fitted our solar uh battery remember we had um let me just show you let me just show you remember we had one battery and we we're still relying on escom so now we don't need we don't need um another i can say we officially off grid so yeah so yesterday we fitted 
another battery so we have two batteries one for giza and then one for everything so now we have the system going uh let me show you where as long as the sun is out for a few minutes i don't know how to put this for a few minutes it will get um the energy will come from the sun so we have the situation now and we also put um a giza uh panels giza panels so we finally have i think we have like 13 panels if i can show you from outside so such things guys um they make me feel so grateful guys so grateful to to all these things that we are actually achieving it is not because um we did anything uh, special but it is by the grace of god so let me just show you i'm outside now Ooh, I, and it looks like i'll have to walk far for you guys to see but yeah let me go so i am outside now i think i should record more outside uh, okay let's just go again because you can see i'm actually going to stand in, on someone's grass so if you look at my house which is that one you'll see panels there at the top there yes at, at the top there and then those are the panels that we got we got 13 panels um one giza one which is the side let me go and show you the giza one let me show the giza one and then we are finally off grid guys like 99 percent off grid it is good news guys it is good news for as long as the sun is out i don't need to buy it so people like us who have um okay can you see that one um that one that one that's the giza one so guys it is um finally finally we've done it we've done it so i am so happy and grateful that we are finally off grid and all of this happened because god allows and god continue to make our lives easy yeah guys i think i talked too much uh, let me just go to my crow and then finish this I have it, and it. Nice. I would never buy that one. Uh -huh. Never. So is it. Uh. Hey, flow, flow, flow. This I'm still questioning. Oh, my This one, milling in a pants. Ew, I can't. It's in sugar, na. Moment. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
They recognized you, Mukiel. They also go by famous. You look familiar. Yes, you saw me on TV. <laughs> Not even close. Not even close. Sing hash. No, yeah. Subscribe. Subscribe. I should have said, get your friends to subscribe also. <laughs> Okay, guys, I am done. Um, I've been finished cleaning. Um, at least my pantry looks clean. So, um, Cremora, I buy a lot because I don't drink, um, I don't take sugar in my tea or coffee. So, I buy a lot of Cremora because I use that as my sugar. And then, conflicts, I couldn't buy more because obviously there was a limit to this budget. I uh, would have loved to buy eight, but I, I couldn't, obviously. And then baked beans. I wanted to buy tin fish, but we don't really eat tin fish that much. So I ended up buying one. And then um, we already have peanut butter, but I bought um, just as extra. And then muesli, tomato sauce, things that we normally use. And obviously this. And then there's more milk at the bottom. Uh, we have milk and then extra maize meal, extra rice there, extra um, fetish and mornings and obviously um well, mascopas is something that we always have in the house and then the tissues remember we have tissues that i bought um last year june 
they're still here so we still have this much i'm hoping this will push us at least two months or three months and then um, i'll keep looking for specials and keep buying and then these are the things that um are can be fitted here in the pantry it lasts longer and then also in the fridge we have also in our bedroom because we had to buy toiletries as well and yeah guys and i still need to wash these containers so i use these containers for my flour for my maize meal and then for my rice so i'll wait for these ones to finish and then i'll wash afterwards i'll put um these ones and this should last yeah. uh, up until i get more money then i'll be able to to buy to keep stocking so basically from here i'm going to buy by um whenever there's a sale on something i'll go buy that in bulk because then i save a lot so milk was cheap guys milk was very cheap like 88 rand and my husband said he bought these ones um it was 100 rand around 100 rand so which was a lot so um uh, if i get money during the week i'll go stock up on this milk because yeah we use a lot of milk in this house and then there was there was obviously these ones um some i bought last time um the dish things and i bought um these ones more i think i keep adding more of uh, donistos and sunlight dishwasher and handy handy and yeah i have that a lot even in the and the other cupboards and then since i use a lot of um dishwashers i bought more tablets for the dishwasher as well so yeah guys i'm um, also got myself soup because uh, we need a lot so with these ones i would really love to have um maybe like five or six of these but obviously the budget was not that much but at least i got to reduce some things and then for for lunch stuff, um, I will be bought uh, the biggest cheese, then I'll cut it in pieces. And um, yeah, obviously they will use that when, yeah, they go to school. So yeah, I am done for today. Um, yeah, obviously you saw the price of how much I spent and um, the things that I spent. So I bought two of these um, chicken, um, remember? I said we buy cow uh, once in a while, I think once in every six months, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so I'm just going to separate these into plastic so that daily I can just um, remove that. So instead of putting this whole thing, I'll just put it in plastic. So let me just rather do that. And then, yeah, you can see how I do it. And then, yeah, put it in the, in the fridge. I must really start to put effort when I go out of this house. So today I met someone at Macro. So I, I'm busy working and busy collecting everything that I needed there. And then this guy keeps watching me, like keep looking at me, staring at me. And then when we got to the tea, he says, I think I know you. You look kind of familiar. Then I said, uh, where did you see me? And then he's like, social media. I was like, oh Lord, I am a celebrity. If people can see me, uh, I wouldn't even call myself a celebrity because really, <laughs> that was funny to to see that people do see me when they go to macro. I mean, so yeah, 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 it's funny. So now I'm going to do this. So I basically buy these uh, plastics from a macro. So it's usually this big. So now I've been using this for months. So I could buy it like your zipper lock, your but um, I don't have money to buy those 12 zip, zip, zip lock. So I usually buy this and then I, I just cut like this. And it's just for me to separate the chicken so that when I cook, I don't go to, to the, you know, this box or and how do I even put this in the fridge? So I just do this. Yeah, I do many guys, I do many. I'll just show you, let me just show you you i'll do this box with you already washed my hands so i'll do this and then a day uh, i'll choose how many people how many pieces a person gets so me and my husband too the rest one one and funny enough they love food and they don't like cooking but my daughter has yes and Jane. sometimes yeah god help us with these teenagers so do this so i'll count which is okay two for me two for my husband one three for the kids and then my husband the following day um remember he doesn't like this so this will be enough for one day 
two for me, two for my husband, two for my husband as well as today. Three for kids. What do they know about um, chicken? I'm all rich and then for maybe I'll, we should just eat chicken once a week, ne? And then I'll try and find fish. We also eat beans. So I do the same thing with beans. I boil beans and then once it is cooked, um, I'll separate into packets. So during the week, we'll eat beans with bones like amatambo. Sometimes beans with um, like only amatambo. And just do different things with those beans. And then other days we eat cheese. Um, uh, Okay, guys, that's it for today's video. Um, I have a lot to do. I still need to pack. There's so many things. Yeah, it's just dirty everywhere. Um, I didn't even finish the dishes in the morning. There's just a lot that I need to do. So I'm just going to finish cleaning while cooking. And then at 7 o'clock, I have a class, um, theology class that uh, we've been doing ever since last year. Yes, yes, where we go through the Bible and just understanding it. For our spiritual growth so yeah guys i hope uh, you are having a lovely day please don't forget to subscribe um this helps me to grow my channel and then um it also helps me to uh really continue to create this content content that is going to help people so expect a video tomorrow no not tomorrow after tomorrow yeah give it a day where i'm going to talk about choice um the choice you know how people are We'll go to church and at the same time they are still going to sangomas like you really need to make a choice either you go to the sangomas or you go to church uh you can't just mix the two so make a choice or maybe someone who's busy um maybe having sexual relations without before getting married before getting married but still going to church and standing in front of people worship and praising so i'll be going more on that this is something that we learn on saturday so i'll share I just need to be seated, make sure I get all the scriptures right. And then, yeah, guys, I love you guys. Take care of yourself. Remember, you have one life. You don't have any backup. Um, whatever you need to do that makes you happy, start building a bridge to get there. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys.